And welcome back, folks. Welcome back to Let's Play Part Planet of Death. I do hope this is recording. When we last left off, we had just repeated a race, uh, and I've been reading out text logs to you. In fact, in fact, that is not true because I just had to replay last level because I got stuck in a corner in this racing track. Let us not get stuck in a corner this time. And that strange graphical glitch uh, also appeared last time. Some textures not being reloaded. And that's the corner I was getting stuck in. Some textures not being loaded. Haha, -ha, you got stuck in the corner, you fool! Not being loaded early enough and then I got stuck in a corner. Yes, getting stuck in a corner is quite easy in this game. Unfortunately the reverse gear is very... and then I got stuck in a corner. The reverse gear in this game sucks. And there's a ship. Yes. A ship that is stranded. Uh... Aha! You managed to get yourself in the corner. And I didn't. These racing tracks are really getting more and more difficult, as you can expect. Already? Yes. I have no one. That's very mean. That's very... Okay, I have no... I'm going in the wrong direction. Okay. That is very, very mean. Okay, I have no idea where I'm going. And I'm on the seventh, seventh place. Okay, sixth place. Okay, fifth place. Four. Fifth place. Okay, but we have still a few laps to go. And that strange graphical glitch did not appear this time. Because the texture had apparently already loaded. The only thing I find uh, curious is that they actually um, and this game supports mirror effects. Aha! Second place. First place, maybe. Okay. Let us see where this guy is going. Let us follow him. Maybe let's not follow him. He is too slow. If he decides to be too slow, okay, that's probably no. Okay. Yes. Ugh. Last time I said, oh, this is a very good way to unwind after a stressful day. That very much depends on the kind of track that you're playing and the level of familiarity that you have with this track. Okay, playing this track certainly is not very a very good way to unwind. I have no idea how much, how many tracks there are to come. I hope that I will be able to read out all the text logs before the end of this let's play. But I think you know the basic story. So we are Derek K. 
Captain Derek Stealth, whose wife has died, as we learned a few text blocks ago, died uh, as a result of the structural damage done to a mall by part. So the building collapsed, the mall collapsed, and uh, Mrs. Diane Stealth died. Also, we have learned last time that the that Ayo is being evacuated. An evacuation order has been put into effect. All ships um, nearby the system have to get rid of their charge of the cargo and help with the evacuation. Yes. So unwinding. Ugh. Yeah. This has not been a very very stress-free day for me. It's been a very stressful day for me, in fact. Because I was being told basically that I am replaceable. Let us continue. Maybe I will manage to do another race. Only seven minutes, that might have been a mistake. But we will see. Yeah, I'm replaceable apparently. Yeah. It is true, it's true of course. But that's not a very uh it's not a nice thing to hear. It's not very it's not something that motivates you. It's a thought that is very destructive, in fact. Also enjoy the nice scenery while I continue to have destructive thoughts. Or rather continue. To dwell on negative destructive thoughts. Hmm. It's very unfair, but People treat you differently just depending on your age. And if you happen to be late in your development, if you happen to need to take more time than others, then life will not be kind, very kind to you. That's in fact one of the the basic problem of our modern of our modern working society. People are replaceable, except maybe for the few lucky ones who are so good at what they are doing that they are in fact irreplaceable. But the majority of people are just. They're nothing more than a workforce. They're not important. It's okay if they do their job. They keep quiet and are functional. If not, then they're just and noise and giant giant uh, insects what appears to be giant insects uh, and very 
ugly cut out, cut out trees. Roaming the uh, roadside. And again we are winning. We are winning this race, even though I'm, ugh, I'm terrible. Terrible and replaceable. And now I got... I just got beaten by two people. See? They are better than me. They are capable of at replacing me. At any given moment. Now I've beaten them, beating other people, being better than other people, just feels good. Just feels good to be better than other people at something. It doesn't matter if you're good at something, but if you're better than most other people, and that's reassuring. That gives you confidence. That already shows how flawed such such a concept of self-esteem is, really. A concept of self-esteem that is only relative to something else is destined to, to lead to insanity. Of course, this analysis will not uh, help you at all. Uh, will not help you at all in this modern working society, but it's. I think. I think it, Accurate description. Okay, and then I, I've lost my train of thought. Sorry, because I was texted someone who uh, said that I should call that person. Um, so I will do that after that race. Hope that it's still. This is the last lap, but it is in fact. Concentrate just a bit and then hopefully this one will be this race will be ours. I do hope this is recording. If not then I'm really really sorry then. This that should be yes. That should be it. Okay, uh, we have still 30 seconds. But never mind. So when we come back, folks, we will continue to have to analyze negative thoughts, or maybe not. Well, we'll continue playing part, at least. So until next time, folks, until then.